Hey guys, Queen Bija, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 5 of season 3 of Is the Order of Rabbit. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. <laughs> Yeah, what are you planning? Oh! <laughs> I mean, but hold up, wait. Oh, we all move the mountain, baby. I, I mean... And now she's gone. My thing is, shouldn't we also be celebrating Maya and Megu's, you know, going to Shadow and Liz's school? Hmm? <laughs> I know, right? Let me put my phone up here just in case my mom calls me and if she does that's when I'm gonna mute my microphone yeah aka the worst thing on earth I used to hate running um the four mile run and uh what elementary no not elementary middle school like mm, no <laughs> we had to do that I think what two times in a year so we had to do it because I lived in Nebraska for six years um we had to do it in the so in total we had to do it four times because we only had two years of middle school in Nebraska so we had to do it once well, really twice in the winter for both years and then twice in like the summer when it starts getting hot again. It was always like the one thing that I dreaded, but it was only, yeah, still fucked up because they just wanted to see how much we like evolved. But then imagine, like, okay, I didn't have to do it in high school, but because of the fact is I had a death in my family, I had to go back to my um, parents' hometown, and in the end, I came back, even though I had to argue with my teacher, um, do the mile run, but instead of me running four laps, I had to run almost about 30 laps in the school, which was fine, but I got it done, like, in... An hour and 30 minutes, I believe. Oh my god! <laughs> Are you training? <laughs> Hell, I did that too in middle school, but not with the tire and everything. I mean, I had my dad take me over to the track that we were using and tried my best. But my biggest thing was I have asthma and when I run and push myself too much, I can instantly have an asthma attack like that. Oh, Gia. Maybe when it's cold, but not like when it's summer and it's too hot outside. Like, I don't understand why people can go out on a run when it is hot as heck here. It is like 80 something degrees, but that's because, you know, it's starting to get cold. But when it's summer here. Oh, oh. Oh my God, baby. I know. I mean, push yourself. 
That is the spirit of determination right there. <laughs> okay. You have to do it yourself. Of course. <laughs> Gia! Gia's me! You got this. Mm, I don't know. Bunny! Poor baby. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that looks so good. <laughs> I mean, like, now I'm kind of starting to like working out because I do want to lose weight and such. But, yeah, I'd be hella tired after I'm done, whether I'm working out for, like, an hour and 30 minutes, maybe even longer. No. You say that, but no. Uh -oh. <laughs> so cute. Oh my god. Stop it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Her bunny is literally my dog. My dog is just laying his butt down right now. Cody. Yeah, he, he just woke up because I called him. He's so cute. So, okay, already right now, we know <laughs> Chia. Huh. Excuse me, oh my god. Chia's gonna do awesome at this. Coco. <laughs> <laughs> Not so much in my opinion. Oh, that's pretty. So worth it. <laughs> no.
excuse me. The biggest thing is at the end of the day, it's about pacing yourself. <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> she ran like fucking Santa Claus with his reindeer, like, yes, go! Yeah! <laughs> You're almost there. <laughs> go, go! <laughs> Come on! <laughs> go, go! Yay! Good job! Oh my God! Mm -hmm. Number one, maybe I don't know. I mean, Coco, you too, kind of. <laughs> I can't with myself. I'm so mean and putty. And now the time is to eat whatever the hell you want to eat, gain a little bit of weight back, but then still work it off at the same time. Like, oh, uh, you know, when you have like a really good workout and you were like, I am going to have that damn cookie or that pasta or, or fucking cheeseburger. Ah, baby, this girl, you're so pretty. Well, what do you want to do? No. Yes. Oh, we're finally getting your name, Rin? I mean, well, okay. Rin has been in this show for what? Like, ever since season one, I believe? I don't remember because, you know, it's been a while since we watched season one, season two in the OVA specials. But we are now getting her name? I mean, oof. But okay. <laughs> you and how you and best girl would hang out. <laughs> <laughs> right as they're going up. Oh my god.
What's up, Tippy? I'm here with the gondola! Tippy! Hmm. <laughs> Gone now. On the other side. I just want this show to make a figure of best girl Aoyama Blue Mountain. That's all I want. Please. Just give it to me. <laughs> I will spend money on the best girl. All these other girls, my children, got figures. Even though I still want that figure of Shadow. But if Aoyama Blue Mountain gets a figure... This is going to be so easy. I will die if she gets a figure. This sure is. And of course you fall for it. My God, Kokola! <laughs> Kokola, the winkest link. <laughs> I know she ain't even running away or anything. She's just like, fuck it. I just want to hug her. Yeah. Well, where else could you go? My thing is, how in the world are they going to catch Chia? Aoyama, yeah, I kind of figure, because Aoyama, best girl, but... <laughs> Chia, I mean... Damn. We doing it like this? She tried. <laughs> Poor Ritsu <laughs> from k <-On. laughs> Huh? Oh my god! <laughs> You're so cute, baby! I know. Mm-hmm. Exactly. Did I just say fairy as well? Mario go around, dummy. But it's cute. Look at my baby. What's wrong? Yeah, it is pretty, isn't it? She gonna make me cry. Oh my god. Oh. 
I'm already tearing up, damn it. Oh my god, what's wrong with me? Do you ever just cry over your best girl and why you love her so much? <laughs> because he, she, whoever, best boy, best girl, they're so precious and you love them so much. <laughs> oh, God. She's so short, even though she's standing on the thing. Oh, she's so pretty. My best girl is so fucking pretty, and I love her so much. Let's go home. Yeah, we have a blue mountain. <laughs> this was the best episode. I mean, any episode where, you know, best girl, Aoyama Blue Mountain is featured or main featured. I mean, still, the, <laughs> the week before my birthday, they was nice enough to go ahead <laughs> and, like, have an episode where she started out in the opening. That was the best thing. That was the best way. I think that was like what? I don't think that was the week of my birthday. That was like the first, the second week of my birthday month. Because my birthday was like the third or fourth week of October. And that was the best way to start this show. I mean, any moment where it is Aoyama Blue Mountain, like y'all already know who my favorite VA is. It's her VA. Anything that she's in, even if she plays the bad guy. Still my best girl. We still support her up in this bitch. I don't care. But she's just, oh my god, I can't. I love her so much. Just release a uh, figure. Going on to Chia and um, her doing the marathon. I think she did an awesome job. Honestly, she makes me want to go out. As someone who really does not like running, I'm more of a walker slash fast walker. She makes me want to go ahead and do that, but... I don't really feel like doing that. I got too many things to do today. I could do it tomorrow because I only have one thing to do, but it's starting to get cold. Oh my god, it's so cute! <laughs> I love her so much. Like, Jesus. I mean... Because of the fact is, I remember hearing her VA, like, I knew her of her VA, like, way, way before I had watched this show, um, and also Idolmaster Cinderella Girls, and so when I did a reaction to Idolmaster Cinderella Girls, like, she, Kaede was not the character who she plays, Sorami plays, um, Kaede was my top top, because I am a cool producer, like, Kaede was the one who was, I was instantly attracted to, and I was like, I, I want her. She's my best girl. I'm going to do everything that I can to get all of her cards. And as of today in the year 2020, I have all of her um, SSR cards. And it's literally the best day, the, the best year for me. Because she came home, her last two cards came home and like two days apart in September. And this was around the time where, like, you know, when we got, like, stimulus checks and everything. And I was like, okay, I'm going to go ahead and do a pull because I got money and I'm using this money on Japanese games. Like, you know, any other freaking anime person who loves anime so fucking much and will gamble for a fucking Wafu or a Husbando will literally do that-ish. And her Sinfest, like, 
came the fuck home and I was crying, laying on my bed, crying at like 11 o'clock in the morning, screaming and freaking out because I've been playing this game. I've been playing Cinderella Girl Starlet Stage for, this is their fourth, three, four years now. And finally, <laughs> this card that I have been dreaming of ever since I first saw it finally came home and then two days later, her newest limited came home because I bought it but I was like it's still a win I was like they're both home and I'm super duper happy so it is still one of my favorite highlights of this year besides getting a switch or anything else and ish like that but yeah this was a really good episode I loved it I mean Chia she did amazing Cocoa <laughs> Cocoa, my girl. I mean, you know what? A for effort, babe. Even though you was holding on to them pigtails for probably how long, who knows how long. But A for effort. You did a good job as well. And I'm proud of both of these girls. But still, it would have been nice for them to also have a celebration for Maya and Megu. Maybe they did it off screen. But it would have been nice if we got to see it in an episode. Because we're not only celebrating Chino going into high school. We're also celebrating Maya and Megu going into high school as well even though they won't be going to the same high school but they'll still be able to hang out and that's something that you want to celebrate with anyone and the fact that you know they haven't really made it yet but still like just moving on to high school and you know slowly but surely starting your high school career and your life and your future and everything that's good I'm just saying but other than that guys that is my reaction view towards episode 5 of season 3 of Is the Order a Rabbit if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel I make videos every single day join the Master Squad and of course I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for episode 6 bye guys